in my recent video or let, let me say one of my recent videos you heard me talk about god being an ancient architect and a wise master builder in an age we are in right now you hear people attacking the office of the prophets the office of the apostle and you don't know where they get all those doctrines from that there is nothing like an apostle there is nothing like a prophet I don't know where they get those doctrines from but to the young man or the young woman out there that you've sensed the call of God upon your life God has called you into the prophetic office or the apostolic office spend time and build yourself and give back to the lost people what the Lord is calling you to give them give to them men didn't call you you are not accountable to men you may have a spiritual father a spiritual parent whom you will submit to but they didn't call you and i'm not saying that there is something there should be something wrong between your spiritual parents or your or um, you and your spiritual parents no that is not what i am saying i'm just trying to encourage you that don't look at people and give up on the gift that god has placed in you don't look at people men didn't call you it is a sacred calling it is a heavenly call that you have received in christ jesus as a prophet or as an apostle or as a prophetess there are women that were prophets in the bible women like deborah even women like anna she was a woman that could hear from god when they gave birth to jesus and they brought jesus to the temple the anna Luke chapter 2, you can read it. She came to the temple, she held Jesus and began to declare upon the life of Jesus. How did she know that they are giving birth to the Messiah and she needed to come there and raise him up and declare the blessings of the Lord over him? It tells you that there were, there were women too that carried the prophetic grace. So, um, Jesus is a wise master builder. Again, he has given fivefold ministers to the church. Apostle, apostle, prophet, um, teachers, evangelists, and pastors. Jesus gave this to the body of Christ. If you don't understand it, don't fight against it. There is a purpose. There is a purpose. Jesus knows what he is doing. He saw before time began that the apostle alone cannot do the work. The teacher alone cannot do the work. The evangelist alone cannot do the work. The prophet primarily will help people to grow in intimacy, to grow in hearing God's voice for themselves. That is one of the one of the major works of the prophet. You will help them. You will train them to know God's voice. All of the fivefold ministers, all, their, their role is to help the Christians to mature in Christ Jesus. That is our responsibility. Everybody is to mature them, to grow in Christ Jesus, to grow in the knowledge of the Son of God and to become mature, attaining to the whole measure of the fullness of Christ. Let us allow the fivefold ministers to operate. Jesus talked about false prophets emerging. You cannot base on a false prophet to discredit all prophets. You cannot base on a false apostle to discredit all apostles. No. In as much as we need to talk about the word of the Lord, we need to preach it and teach it, we also have to address this so that you will not be carried away by everything that you see on the media that there are no genuine men of God, there are no genuine prophets, there are no genuine apostles. Jesus talked about false prophets emerging. Jesus talked about it. The wolves will be among the sheep. Jesus talked about it. Yeah, so they will be here. So praise be to God that the prophecy Jesus gave is being fulfilled. But in the midst of all the prophecies, God still have men that are here. God is having people. So it could be you. God wants to use you. I'm only speaking to a young man or a young woman out there. That God has called you with the prophetic and apostolic grace. But because of where you find yourself, you want to give up on that gift. You want to give up on that call. Don't give up. The cloud of witnesses are waiting to celebrate with you. Don't give up. We will rejoice with you. Don't give up. Don't give up. The Lord bless you.